Hello and welcome to World Walking. This is Dynamite Soul Eric Walker. And as you can see, we're doing things a little differently for episode three. And so, here we go. So, what's on tap for today? Well, it will be my excursion to the Netherlands and my debut for Dutch Pro Wrestling. So, I got to see a lot of interesting things while I was there. I took a trip to Zanse Shans, to the notorious windmill village that they have there. To where I got to see how Dutch clogs were made. Now, for the longest time, I just thought they were just ceremonial or decorational things, but no, turns out they were used for everyday things, including work clogs, horses hat clogs, and then all the different ceremonial and amazing designs that you come across, including the immaculate diamond clog. And to see a pair get made from a wooden block to a finished clog was an amazing process. And there were just multiple ones on the wall you could just buy in your own size to take home. As well as the numerous types you could see in the village, including the giant ones you can try on for size. And I got to see the cheese making process, which to see an authentic wheel of cheese get made is a unique experience that not many people get. And of course, there's just the natural beauty of the village. For instance, the cat windmill is the only windmill in the world that still produces paint. Now, unfortunately, the donut shop that I intended to visit while I was in Amsterdam was unfortunately closed for over the weekend. But I still got to debut in country number nine. Let me tell you this, Dutch Pro Wrestling, top rate organization. And look at those graphics. Look at my pretty face, man. Awesome. And in regards to my match, I did manage to apply what I learned in Denmark and that is to be wary of my surroundings during multi-man matches. And while I did apply this during the course of a pin, my opponent was just fast enough to eliminate me from the decision in the match. And there it is. Another country down, plenty more to go. And so I will see you next time.